The human musculoskeletal system. Muscles give support and cause movement. The bones of the skeleton provide a solid framework. We have voluntary control over most of our muscles. For example, the biceps muscle, which bends the arm. Most skeletal muscles are constructed in the same way. Each muscle is made up of many muscle fiber bundles. In turn, each of these bundles is made up of many muscle fibers, which are specially formed muscle cells. Myelinated neurons end on the muscle fibers. They transmit movement impulses to the muscle. Transmission happens at the thickened ends of these nerves, which are known as motor end plates. Skeletal muscle fibers typically have stripes across them. The stripes are made by actin and myosin, the main constituents of the muscle cell. Myosin, actin, troponin. Muscle movement is caused by the movement of actin and myosin. The signal from the motor neuron causes calcium ions, CA for short, to flow into the muscle cell. The calcium binds to troponin, which changes its shape. This exposes the binding site of actin, which now binds myosin. ATP binds to the myosin and causes the actual movement. The splitting of ATP into ADP and a phosphate ion, shortened here to PI, provides the energy that is needed. Then the myosin lets go and the cycle can start all over again.